At Wednesday's EDC board meeting, Chairman Fred Richardson said the corporation received more than 50 applicants to replace Brad Lofton as CEO. Richardson says the search committee settled on one unnamed candidate who stood out from the rest. That candidate is still under consideration by the executive committee. Uh, the candidate will be announced uh, Friday, uh, introduce the county council uh, to ask for them to ask questions. Since the EDC receives county funding, it is considered a public body. According to South Carolina's Freedom of Information Act, all materials gathered by a public body during a search to fill an employment position relating to not fewer than the final three applicants under consideration must be made available for public inspection. Richardson says the EDC is within its rights to withhold the candidate's name for the time being. Yeah, I think we have to receive a freedom of information request, or we could, and I think we have a certain amount of time to respond to that. News Channel 15 has filed a Freedom of Information Act request to discover the candidate's identity. The FOA law allows a public body up to 15 days to respond. Richardson says there will be plenty of time for public scrutiny of the candidate before he's approved. We will, we will guarantee an adequate amount of time.